Hello everyone, I'm glad you could be here with me. I'm Mr. Kitten and I am back with some more 2D Revolution. And I am back to YouTube. And as good news, I am officially done with school for a while, so I'll have plenty of time to make videos. And also, I forgot, there are some new challenges that I need to do. But before we get to that, I want to finish up, not that, Beta Outskirts. So, we did day, we fought a blue spider po, so now we're gonna go tonight and fight an orange lala. Alright, that's gonna be cool, so let's do it! Here we go, and it is pretty dark. And we have the soundtrack that always accompanies the outskirts, which I like a lot. Now, where are they? I haven't played this map in a while, so I'm gonna have to get familiar with it again, but it shouldn't be too hard. There's one. Oh, I forgot. These guys have more health. Why oh, there's some blue guys. Majority of them are blue guys. And there we go. Pretty simple. But these variants, like always, are gonna be causing me some problems. Mostly because of their high health. That's like the one thing I remember from this, so can't wait to look forward to that. I do like the little icon in the top right corner. It's very nice. Jeez, I expected him to go down. There we go. Wait. There we are. Now you have these guys. They look like they have barbed wire on their heads. Oh, not those guys. Alright, we're gonna wait here for a while. No blue guys. Come on. I'm gonna try and fire really quickly, just to take them out as quick as I can. That's not... It's not working out. Oh, there we go. Oh, well, I thought I wasn't going to kill him with the clip, but he's dead. Because we have a lot of points now. And on to wave three. Headless newborns. No, they don't really cause me much trouble. It's just their hitboxes. You have to aim kind of specifically with them. Take these guys out. I think I can take both of them out. Nope. I thought it was just gonna be one hit. Alright, can you die? Thank you. I'm gonna have to get used to this. Even the headless team works up a lot of health. Okay, never mind. They are gonna be a problem for me. Oh yeah, spider droids. And I think it's just the blue guys that are left. Well, they're new enemies. Oh, I was referring to the ones that are off screen. I think we might be able to get a shotgun before wave 4 again. Yeah, with this it seems very likely that we will. I've gone across the entire map. I, oh, I did not see them. There we go. We have a shotgun. And thank you. They're dead now. Now, the range newborns compared to these guys, they shouldn't cause too many problems. Although I do occasionally do I occasionally get hit by them. Oh, it mostly happens when I don't see them and they're off screen. Or they travel really far for some reason. Alright, don't have to worry about it. Quite a bit is down. Alright, oh, what are those guys? Oh, they're dead, so I don't have to worry about them.
I think this orange guy is me really quickly. Seems like they're the fastest orange. Maybe the runners are, actually. But they don't have a lot of health. Alright, come on. No? There we go. Now it's time for the Scorpion Newborn. There he is. Oh yeah, and he looks different. It's coming back to me now. It's just a bit rough early game, but hopefully the late game won't be so bad. I can deal with the boss well enough, but I just don't want them to be moving quickly. The boss is moving quickly is very dangerous. This guy doesn't move quickly, so he's a piece of cake. And not a very strong attack, but he is the first mini boss, so I wouldn't expect much from him. And there we go. We still have full health, but I'll just take that med kit. Alright, do they spawn over here? Okay. Well, it's good that I found the spawn point. I'm gonna try and take out these purple chainsaw guys. I don't know why I call it a chainsaw. It just has, like, spikes on both sides, and that's what a chainsaw is, so I have chainsaw. These guys are just so durable. Wait, I think I can take them out. There we go. Oh, I think I got someone. I don't know if I killed someone, but I think I did hit them. I don't know how he almost survived the full clip. Variants are insane. Look at the range the ones out of here. You know what? I think I will save up for uh what is that? MK16, MK16. Because it's easy enough. It just requires a lot of patience. So take out the range of the ones first and then deal with the other guys. Well, okay, these guys first, obviously. Oh, there's the phantoms. They haven't changed. Well, they don't have a new model. Well, they just look they just look the same. So I'll just take them out. And there we have it. I hate how you stop moving. Although sometimes I feel like I get the gun and I'm still moving. I don't know. Alright, that was good. Okay, the headless keyboard is down. Gotta keep moving. Alright, nice. This does, this does really good damage. Now it's time for the mini announcer. Whatever it may be. I'm assuming up here. Move to the side so I don't get attacked by it immediately. Okay, found it. Oh, I think I. Yeah, I shot a bullet to my right. Well, maybe I didn't? I don't know. So bad to take down. But sometimes he can get you if you're not careful. Club bosses, you just have to stay far away from them. I don't know why I'm taking such big risks. Alright, I think one more round should do it. There we go. Got it. 
now we can move on to wave 7 with a powerful gun. Alright, the Sprinter Newborns, or whatever they're called. I'd call them Sprinter Newborns. I'm sure they have an actual name, but I don't know it. Oh no, the droids. Because this is, I guess, going off classic? Or Sunday Tips 3. Or good, I took out that. Alright, and fire! Oh, that one's running at me. There we go. Alright, gotta go up here. Okay, that spider got pretty close. Look at that blue one. Oh, reach the board. And there we go. There we have it. Way they blow the board. First we need to get to the circles and all the other guys. Purple guys, okay. Didn't expect to see the circle. Everyone to the right? No. That was just my imagination. The fandoms are pretty weak. Three, five droids. Take them out pretty easily. Good, I took that one out. I'm gonna go in the path. Oh, I see the range still right there. How'd I shoot that guy? Okay, good, took both of them out. Oh, that's the edge. Oh, and I missed again. Can't get the spider drill. But I can get this. Oh, see, I keep walking. Wow, they're really strong. Are they as strong as the Berserker? Well, that gives some new light on it. Why did he need to be this strong? Oh, well, I guess he can be that strong, but why did he appear so early? Starting at wave 2. Let's just take out this Blunder Warren. Shouldn't take too long with this. It looks a little different than I remember. I don't know. Maybe it's the two horns, because I always remember him with a horn broken off. Alright, get away. That was close. Oh no. Got him. Alright. Penultimate wave. The quote unquote last wave. Well, let's not run into the tree. That's a bad start. Okay, why do there need to be so many berserkers? I'm gonna take out the purple guys. Oh no. Oh, I took both of them out. Oh, the berserker got in the way. Oh, he didn't run. I don't know how many shots the berserkers take. I'm gonna have to test that. I can't really test it right now. I don't know, maybe four. Although I might have hit him already. Okay, I've listed our chicken out. Just rinse and repeat. Nope. 
Get the range of words away from me. Oh, I think I missed. Whoa, that almost hit me. That was really close. It was really small. I almost didn't even see it. And there we go. That's all the waves done, so it's time for Lala. I'm assuming. Oh yeah, I think this is Lala's theme, and I accidentally shot there. Low amount of health, so I'm expecting them to be pretty fast. It's either low amount of health and fast speed, or a lot of health but slow speed. I can't tell if that's more orange or red. It looks more red. Uh oh. It is Lala. Ooh, I, do, I do like this music. Okay, gotta be careful and not go to the edge of the map. Uh, I feel like... Oh no. I feel like going down is the worst since I think you move faster going to the left and right. I think it's a little thing that I've noticed. Of course you go faster when you go like this. So far I'm pretty sure I've landed all my shots. You know, this doesn't seem too bad. Oh, she's catching up. I think I need to go to the left. Seems like she only has a fireball attack, but I'm assuming if it hits me, that's really good damage on me. Oh, well, I think I was out of range. Okay, at least it takes her just a little while for her to launch her attack, so I think it's enough for me to react in time. Okay, at least it doesn't go too far. Don't really know why they decided to make her that color. Or different color. I don't really know. I don't know if a different color would have worked better or worse. I was thinking maybe it's because the Teletubbies is swapping colors with the other Teletubbies, but... Well, I was mainly thinking of the main four, but there's no blue Teletubby of the main four. That'd be cool. Red Lala, Yellow Poe. Eh, I don't know. I'm just thinking out loud here. Okay, we're almost done here. I'm gonna kind of cut across. Okay, almost there. One more should do it. And there she goes. Just exploded. Alright, that was pretty fun. Like I predicted, a bit of a difficult early game to get through, but the late game wasn't so bad. So that was Beta Outskirts at Night for Survival, and next time we'll return to Dawn, which I'm pretty sure has the blue spider po. finish Survival up on Beta Outskirts, then we'll go and do the challenges. I completely forgot about them, so they're coming up soon. So with that, that will be the end of today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. I hope you have an amazing day. Goodbye!